In this video, we will talk about the divisibility rules for the numbers 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9, and 10. Let's start with number 2. A number is divisible by 2 if the last digit is 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. For example, the number 524 is divisible by 2 because the last digit is 4. And 524 divided by 2 is 262. The number 3576 is also divisible by 2 because the last digit is 6. And 3576 divided by 2 equals 1788. So if a number ends in 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8, that number is divisible by 2. A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of its digits is also divisible by 3. For example, number 42 is divisible by 3 because if we add the digits 4 and 2, we get 6 and 6 is also divisible by 3. Then 42 divided by 3 is 14. Now let's see another example. 357 is divisible by 3 because if we add the digits 3, 5, and 7, we get 15 and 15 divides by 3. Then 357 divided by 3 is 119. So if we add the digits of a number and we get a number that is divisible by 3, then this number is also divisible by 3. A number is divisible by 4 if the last two digits are zeros or the last two digits form a number that is divisible by 4. For example, the number 600 is divisible by 4 because the last two digits are zeros. 600 divided by 4 is 150. The number 916 is also divisible by 4 because the last two digits are 1 and 6 and 16 divides by 4. Then 916 divided by 4 is 229. So if the last two digits of a number are zeros, then this number is divisible by 4. And if the last two digits of a number form a number that is divisible by 4, like in this example 16 is divisible by 4, then the whole number is divisible by 4. A number is divisible by 5 if the number ends with 0 or 5. For example, 210 is divisible by 5 because this number ends in 0. And 210 divided by 5 is 42. The number 7415 is also divisible by 5 because this number ends with 5. Then 7415 divided by 5 is 1483. So if a number ends with 0 or with 5, this number is divisible by 5. A number is divisible by 6 if the number is divisible by both 2 and 3. For example, number 84 is divisible by 6 because this number is divisible by both 2 and 3. We know that a number is divisible by 2 if it ends with 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. This number ends with 4, therefore it is divisible by 2. Also, this number is divisible by 3 because if we add the digits 8 and 4, we get 12 and 12 is divisible by 3. Therefore, the number 84 is divisible by 6 and the result is 14. Let's see one more example. The number 138 is divisible by 6 because this number is divisible by both 2 and 3. This number is divisible by 2 because it ends with 8 and it is also divisible by 3 because the sum of the digits 1, 3, and 8 gives us 12, and 12 is a number that is divisible by 3. Therefore, 138 is divisible by 6, and the result is 23. 
A number is divisible by 8 if the last three digits are zeros or they form a three-digit number that is divisible by 8. For example, the number 3000 is divisible by 8 because the last three digits are zeros. And 3000 divided by 8 is 375. The number 5168 is also divisible by 8 because the last three digits 168 form a number that is divisible by 8. 168 divided by 8 is 21. Therefore, 5168 is also divisible by 8 and the result is 646. So, if in a number the last three digits are zeros, or they form a number that is divisible by 8, then the whole number is divisible by 8. A number is divisible by 9 if the sum of its digits is also divisible by 9. For example, the number 2781 is divisible by 9. And that is because if we add the digits 2, 7, 8 and 1, we get a number that is divisible by 9. This number is 18. Therefore, the number 2781 is also divisible by 9 and the result is 309. Let's see another example. The number 117 is divisible by 9. And that is because if we add the digits 1, 1 and 7, we get 9 and 9 is divisible by 9, therefore 117 is also divisible by 9. The result will be 13. And a number is divisible by 10 if the last digit is 0. For example, the number 370 is divisible by 10 because the last digit is 0 and 370 divided by 10 is 37. The number 2500 is also divisible by 10 because the last digit is 0 and 2500 divided by 10 is 250. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.